Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. On today's video, I am going to do an easy look. I usually come in the video with my brows done, but I thought it would be dope just to start from the very beginning. So of course, um, I just got the shower, so my skincare is done. But everything outside of skincare, I am going to do with you guys. Now, if y'all ain't doing nothing, why don't you just get your makeup and we can do our makeup together and chit chat. I am going to try and make this video not too long, but y'all know when you're doing brows with it. Brows, I think, is like the longest thing to do, honestly. So... I don't want to talk too much. I do want to just hop in. I am using um, the Maybelline New York Lasting um, Drama. I don't know if this is um, eyeliner or pomade, but it works good for me. Some strokes in the beginning. Instead of using a brighter concealer under here, I've been using basically LA Pro Conceal in the shade Beautiful Bronze, which is pretty much my shade. I'm taking my um, Tarte Shape Tape. I'm just going to put a dab on each eyelid. And today I'm using a Sonia Kashuk beauty sponge. And I'm just going to blend it out. So the first shade I am going to go into is this brick red shade that I just stuck my nail in. The colors are not in the back, but I'm going to take this and put it in my crease. So I'm just blending this in my crease and a little up. For my lid color, yeah, I want to use this one. And I want to spray and pack this on my lid. I'm just going to do the same thing on the other side. I just line my eyes a little bit. I'm going in with my Milk Hydro Grip Primer. And I've learned, I think I said this in another video, but I've learned the tip to making your, <laughs> the tip to making your makeup last all day is to thoroughly and evenly rub in your primer. Like, you can't just sit it on there, on your skin, and expect it to do what you need it to do. You have to rub it in. And with this one, it kind of tells me because it gets tacky. Now, I have been using the Ease Drop um, Tinted by Fenty Beauty, but this is also a favorite of mine. This Urban Decay Stay Naked Hydromaniac Tinted Glow Hydrator. This has been like, I've been really enjoying using this product as well. Let's just put some all over. And I'm using my Sonia Kashuk sponge to blend that out. And this product you can build up as well. This is a buildable product, but I really enjoy the skin-like look of it. Like, look at it. I am going to highlight a little bit my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer under my eyes. I'm going to do a little bit here. The rest there. 
anything on this side. I am so nervous. I be so nervous filming videos, y'all. Like, I'm still not 100% comfortable, so the words I use may not be the proper words, but y'all know what I mean, I hope. And if you don't know what I mean, comment it below and I'll tell you. I'm taking the excess and doing the bridge in my nose and my forehead. I'm not going to put separate products in these areas. So we're going to take the Laura Mercier and set. Down the bridge of my nose, my forehead. I'm just going to drag some right here. To set my face, I'm using my black opal um, in the shade dark deluxe finishing powder. That's my face. I'm using my minted palette. This is my favorite bronzer. My Mac Raisin. I love this. This has been a staple. I purchased it and repurchased it multiple times. I have not been using any type of highlighter lately. I've just been glowing from within, I guess, because my makeup looks perfectly fine without it. There's no judgment. All of us, we all love highlighter, including me. I just haven't been feeling it as much lately, so... I'm not using any today. I'm going to go in and set my face with the Urban Decay All Nighter. I'm going to take the butt of my Sonia Kashuk sponge and press that in. I'm going to put on my mascara. I start with this one. It's a process, y'all. And now I go on with my Lily Lashes mascara. And it just elevates them to another level. The only issue I have with it is that it makes my lashes stick together. Finishing touches. Shutting my brows. That is pretty much it. I'm going to come back to y'all when I'm outside. So y'all can really see like what this looks like. I know this is kind of weird, but I wanted y'all to see my look in natural daylight. And I'm about to leave. This is what it looks like in natural daylight. It's still glowy. It's still beautiful. It looks better than when I'm in front of my vanity. So, with that being said, if you made it to the end, I would ask that you subscribe to my channel. Y'all go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Like my video if you did enjoy it. And if you have any comments or questions, comment them um, below. Until next time, guys, stay safe.